still doing okay. I'm gonna do something right now. This is something I like to do during every single show. The reason we do it, you can kind of see in the in the screen there, we have these little things in our ears. They're called in-ear monitors, and they uh, they help us hear the music. But at the same time, they're very isolating from you guys, which is not a good feeling. So just for like a minute or two, I'm just gonna like point out people in the crowd that I've seen thus far into the show that have sort of caught my attention. Oh yeah, along the way. I like this. Yeah. I know where I'm going first. I know where I'm going. And I'm going right there. Right here, second row. Why don't we just like, there we go, yes. So, tonight you think, I don't, that's not, what is that? A what? A narwhal. A, boy, I don't know anything tonight, do I? I should have known. Everyone here in, in Louisville knows everything about narwhals. A narwhal! Boy. Boy, anyway, the reason I've pointed the narwhal out is because uh, they were in the, in the second row, and uh, I, I saw some interesting behavior, and I saw very, very quickly how quickly she regretted wearing this outfit to the show. And it, it, it was fairly quick, and it happened sort of through the songs. I don't think she predicted this was going to happen. So what happened was, came out on stage, we started singing Sober Up, and she's singing along pretty vehemently. She's going... Won't you help me, Sobra? And I want to feel something again. And then she sort of looks down and goes, like, maybe that's not something a narwhal would say. And then later on, we were singing the good part. And at the very end, I just see her go, Mom and Dad, they have a good life, but what am I going to do with... And that was just sort of the, your origin story right there. Your whole life's going to be different after that, right? <laughs> <laughs> I love it. You look great. Of course. Wow. I saw something interesting. You saw someone? Yeah, right here. Uh, the man that's in a couple, mm. maybe, maybe a little slightly older than me. I'm not sure how to say it. There you go. Hands up there. No, you look the same age. Yeah. Just dying not to offend anyone. <laughs> He's just slightly older than me. Yeah. Um, <laughs> there we go. Give him this cheer and I'll... I mean, honestly, there's a pretty striking resemblance there, I'm not gonna lie. Look at those glasses. Did you dress up as Ryan for the show tonight? Look at this guy, I love it. So, uh, yeah. I, I, I have a little story about him. Go for it. You seem really tired. Wow. Um, I've seen you yawn twice so far this show. In awesome. fact, one of, the, one of the times, let me explain, one of the times was during the good part. Um, I think you saw me maybe see you yawn, and it was during, can we skip to the good part, and you committed, you went, <laughs> Just no denying that, huh? No. I feel like when everyone comes to these shows, they're like, I could do what I want in the audience, they're not gonna see. That's not true, we have shit on every single person here right now. We see everything. We see it all! Yeah. You know what else I gotta do? Gotta do this. This is something that we've been doing. There's some interesting signs. Before I get to it, by the way, there's some pretty aggressive signs in the audience. We got Team Ryan right there. I feel like in the beginning of the show, we got, yeah. In the beginning of the show, I kind of tried to sort of make the peace with Ryan, and now realizing that you don't want any peace between Ryan and I. They're making teams now? There's teams? Did you put her up to this? I don't know what to do with that. I, I... That's terrible acting. You 